2017, 2500, 6.7 Cummins. And even though the truck only has 13,000 miles on it, I'm six months overdue on an oil change because Ram and the owner's manual wants me to change it every six months. It's been one year next week. And this oil only has 1,127 miles on this oil change, 93%. And that's with towing nothing. And because the engine has a deep knock in it, And because of the knock, I'm going to go ahead and send this oil sample off to Blackstone and just maybe get some little bit of information on it. The truck is going on four years old. I think my powertrain warranty is up at the end of five. I have nothing on record with Ram except a verbal complaint. And I have this from Blackstone Labs. On the last oil test at 4,300 miles, the iron content was 71. That's nearly three times the universal average of 24. And Blackstone thinks that that's the only thing that they could contribute to the deep knock. Their opinion is it isn't ideal. Of course, you don't really know where it's coming from. I'm not going to do TBN on this one because that's another, I don't know how much more that is. Anyway, I think an old test is $30 or $28, something like that. But I'm going to go ahead and do it. That way I'll have some kind of record if something happens and I have to go to RAM on it. I realize not much can show up on 1100 mile oil change. But towing nothing, it should be very, very low. Even though it's only got 1100 mile on this oil, I'm going to go ahead and send off a sample to Blackstone. I'm just real curious about the iron content in parts per million. That's the Geno's magnetic drain plug. Okay, now we'll get our sample for Blackstone. Yeah, we'll take a look at the magnetic drain plug. Looks pretty good. Of course, it, the truck never towed anything, and it's very low miles on it. I was very careful on bringing it in here. Let's see what we get on it. Basically, that is going to be it right there. Last time I changed oil in it, there was like 10 times that amount. There was actually a significant amount of real fine black oily powder on it, fine metal. Of course, Blackstone Labs, they measure down into parts per million. Okay, here's the oil analysis back from Blackstone Labs. There's a slight contradiction in it, but right off the bat, the only thing I'm really concerned about is the iron content. You can see 25 parts per million with just 1130 miles on the motor oil. This oil is regular Rotella T, 15W40, Dyno, whatever you want to call it, nothing fancy. And in their comments, this interval was shorter than your previous two, which I told them that, 1130 miles. No contamination was found. Here's the part that contradicts what the last one said. The last one at 4300 miles and 71 parts per million on the iron, they indicated that was something to be concerned about because it should be well past the broken period. Right here, looks like a nice engine as you cross the 13,000 mile mark. I'm not so sure if 1130 miles pulling absolutely nothing, just itself, is a good indicator or not. So that's what I'm looking at, it's 25. Let's scroll over and look at the universal averages while we're here. And here is Blackstone's universal averages, 4, 1, 24. Five. 
compared to mine. TBNs ran really good in the previous uh, 6.5 and a 7.1, which is very high at 3,800 and 4,300 miles on the oil. Well, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to leave them in the comment section. Have a good one.